Hey guys, what's up? This game, Soccer Manager 18, is unreleased and won't be out for at least another month or two. At least, it's supposed to come out in January, the start of 2018, but I was lucky enough to be one out of the billions of billions to beta test it. So, I did take the chance too. Because, well, I, I, I love soccer games, so. Let's just get into it uh, right here. So, some of the things that I got from this game is that one of the sweetest things is that you use real players, actual real players, with some decent enough stats, I believe. I believe Messi was 90, 90 something. So, the stats are almost there, like with FIFA, but it's not really FIFA stats. The players get updated regularly, so, so they say in this. You have a 3D look at the game when it plays, and it does look good sometimes. The match is, is it's not that long that you want to hang yourself, but it's not that short that you want to say, hey, I, 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 this game was so short or something like that. It's not that short, and you can actually speed up the speed of the game with these to oh 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 fast before the match end. There's a lot of things in training, and so is the stadium. The stadiums very very look like the actual stadiums of each team. That's cool, and. I'm gonna go into the game to show you a little bit more our in-depth look at it. I just hope that the screen recorder doesn't crash because this game is as it says unreleased so it won't run that smoothly. I tried recording it the first time and it did crash so I won't go very far all over in the game and stuff. At the start of the, the, the game, you're gonna get your message from the ass assistant manager that is gonna bring you through the tutorial and it's gonna be a long one. But it goes through everything from scouting to transfers, loans, everything in the game and it actually spans a good distance because I, I, I am actually not finished with it. It goes through every single thing to make you know about the game as much as possible. So, like, if you're first to this kind of game, it's best to go through it, I believe. And the next wonderful thing is that they they actually do the Champions League draw and the Europa League draw in front of you. So, in group A is Manchester City, Borussia Dortmund, Shakhtar Donetsk, and FC Porto. I'm gonna try to see if I can go through them fast. In the second group, we have. Met Sevilla, <laughs> Paris Saint Germain, and some other team. Manchester United, AS Roma, Spartak, and Napoli in Group C. And in Group D, we have Atletico Madrid, Tottenham Hotspur, Nice, and Baza. Group E, we have. Wait a minute. Real Madrid, Fernroyd, Offenheim, and Anderlecht. And in Group F, we have Liverpool, Juventus, Olympiacos, Ajax. The team that I'm using is Barcelona, and they're supposed to be in this group with Celtic, Bayern Munich, Sporting, and yeah, Barcelona. 
I think Barcelona and the Bayern are going through in that group. And AS Monaco, Leipzig, Benfica, Chelsea in Group H. And those Champions League matches, I am not gonna go through. I'm not gonna go through the season until it's released and see if I can go through it with you guys. So this game provides the real managerial experience. It has everything that you expect out of a manager game and it's just well organized and well built. And I can't wait for this game to be released to everybody. The matches are absolutely great I believe. You have a certain part where they play the match very fast and like when there is something important going to happen, the game will slow down the pace and you'll actually see what's going on. I'm not sure how that will work for like when you're tactical, tactically analyzing the game because it moves so fast but it, it, we'll get used to it in time. And the first match I won 4-1, it was a friendly match. but. I won't start the season yet until the game is released and I'm gonna do some transfer and stuff so the game is overall a good game awesome in every single sense real players real leagues there's just so much to love about the game so I do recommend playing it or at least trying it when it comes out so with that I want to thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time.